Hello everybody! Começando mais um vídeo aqui no Dicas de Inglês by Joe, dessa vez com o Lourenço, que é meu aluno, e começou a estudar inglês aqui na escola comigo e não sabia nada de inglês, e nem na sua escola tinha inglês, né Lourenço? Sim. Na escola regular que ele estudava não oferecia inglês, e agora já é fluente. Acompanha comigo essa história, hein? Uh! Olha, antes da gente começar o vídeo, eu quero falar uma coisa que eu sempre falo, que inglês muda vidas. Pois é, inglês muda vidas e você pode aprender essa língua também. Como? Assistindo vídeos, séries, filmes, meu canal, com certeza, né, Lorena? Instagram também, que eu posto dicas de inglês todos os dias. E hoje você vai conhecer um pouquinho da história do Lourenço, como que ele fez pra aprender inglês, quais são as coisas que ele, né, seguiu. Nós estamos com a luz do dia, não tá com iluminação hoje, então se mudar aí... I'm so sorry, alright? <laughs> 2019 promete coisas aí, vai lá me seguir no Instagram que você vai ser o primeiro a saber assim que essas coisas começarem a entrar em prática, alright? E olha, acione, e olha, acione, e olha, acione as legendas, você tem opção, Jesus Lourenço, Jesus. Acione as legendas, você tem a opção de legendas em inglês e em português Preferencialmente em inglês, para você praticar o seu inglês Porque o nosso vídeo vai ser totally in English Então nós vamos somente falar inglês nesse vídeo Alright, Lorenzo? Alright. Are you ready? Yeah, I am So let's go Alright, so Lorenzo, how old were you when you started studying English? I think I, were about, I was about... Nine years old. Nine years old. All right, that's great. And was it difficult for you in the beginning? In the beginning, it was. Yes. How? Because I didn't had any connection with the language before. The only things I knew were like hello, goodbye, uh -huh. good morning. Good morning. But I didn't had a real connection with the language until I entered the school and start having classes. And watching movies, mm -hmm. watching series. That's great. How old are you now? I'm 12. You're 12 years old. Yeah. My gosh. So you've been studying English for like four years. Yeah. Four long years. time. That's great. So. Actually, it's not a long time, right? It's a short yeah. time because now you're fluent. You speak English fluently. So that's amazing. That's Thank great. You. How do you feel about speaking English uh, like 12 years old and fluent in English? How do you feel about it? I feel it? amazing because I know that this is. This is an opportunity that all the children have. Mm -hmm. And I'm so blessed to have this opportunity and it's actually quite amazing. That's great. Yeah. Wow. And uh, when you started studying English, was it you or it was your parents who wanted you to study English? Both. Both. You wanted my, to study? Yeah. My sister already studied and my parents were looking for a school and I already wanted to learn English because I watched already a lot of series and videos and I didn't understand all the things that were being said and I already wanted and then when this, this reason to study mm -hmm. came I was so happy because I really wanted to learn Amazing, so you had an opportunity yeah, yeah. and you took it Great, amazing. And Lorenzo, why do you think English is important today? Because most of the jobs that you get mm -hmm. can get in the future or today kind of is a stable to know how to speak English mm -hmm. and like you normally get paid a little bit more for this. You're right. And it's actually a life, a life learning. You will not, it will not get out of your brain Never. Mm -hmm. Just if you stop practicing. That's the thing. We have to keep practicing, yeah. right? You're right. How do you uh, practice English? I watch series every day. I watch. I listen to songs. I watch series, videos. Do you watch Dicas de Inglês by Joe? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Are you saying that just because you're in front of the camera? No. or? Okay, that's great. I hope so. <laughs> And Lorenzo, do you already know what you want to do in the future? My dream until today is to be a teacher. Mm -hmm. But just the future knows what's mm. in wow. front of me. Just the future knows. Lorenzo. <laughs> Great. Thank you. And Lorenzo, do you think English will help you become a teacher? Yeah, a lot. How? Because not only like an English teacher, I think, 
need to know how to speak English.、Mm-hmm. I think that everyone should know just a little bit. I'm sus- suspect because I love English, but I think it's an opportunity that everyone should have to take it or to don't take it. Amazing. But just to be presented to you. Okay, great, amazing. There are probably people who are 12 years old too watching this video. And what tip do you give for for them? What do you think they should do? How do you think they should study? So help them. Practice. Looking, I learned, looking at the camera.、Yeah. I learned one thing from him. Look at the mirror and speak whatever you want. Whatever. Doesn't mean doesn't matter if it's right or wrong. Yeah. Just speak because when you're in front of the mirror alone, it's the best moment to speak English. You're right. Because you're with yourself and you trust you.、Yeah. You will not laugh of yourself. I do. Sometimes, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Sometimes we will, right? <laughs> when I fall. <laughs> you're right. Um and um, Lorenzo. Da. My gosh, I keep saying Lorenzo all the time. Lorenzo, Lorenzo, Lorenzo. I'm so sorry. I'll, I'll stop、no、it,、problem. right? Lorenzo. <laughs> <laughs> There are a lot of parents who think that、uh, kids or、uh, or children or their children have to be older to start learning English. They think that nine years old or maybe twelve years old is not the right age to start studying English. What do you have to? Tell them. I want you to look at the camera, and now you're gonna have a conversation with the parents.、Uh, I want you to give them a tip. Why should they put their kids to study English when they're young? Oh, because like the younger you are, the better you will learn. Because you're practicing every day until you get older. If you're already old, you will learn a little bit low, slower. It won't be as fast as a kid learning. I know a lot of kids that speak English, and I think it's great. I have a video、um, that I talk about it.、Uh, the、yeah. right age to start studying English. You can check it out. Click in here.、Um, but yeah, everybody can learn English. But I believe that you, if you start younger, it will be better. You will learn、yeah. faster. Not better, but it will be faster, right? It will、yeah. be a faster process. There is another question. Do you think it's possible for people to study alone, to study at home? Yeah. Yeah. How? Help them. I know a lot of persons, mainly the ones that don't want to pay for it, but want to learn. Yeah. Like some YouTubers learn English by themselves, playing games, watching series, reading books. It's the best thing, even if you study at a school. If you practice, it will be better every single day. Great. So the thing is practice, watching series, watching movies, all in English. Yeah. Do you recommend them to put subtitles or watch it without subtitles? When it's a series that I like, want to understand everything,、mm-hmm. I still put these subtitles because if I miss one word, I just get in the context. But if you're already secure of watching series without subtitles, subtitles. Don't put them. They won't help too much. Okay, amazing, great. Last but not least, this is a very deep question, right? I want you to think well before answering it. Does the English language change lives? In my opinion, it does. How? Because, in my opinion, life is made up out of opportunities. To learn English is actually an opportunity.、Mm-hmm. So it will give you more options of jobs, of careers to follow, more opportunities for a lot of things in the future. So it helps if you already learn this. So it's never too young or too old to learn English. You're right. That's great. Congratulations, Lorenzo. Thanks. Lorenzo, thanks for everything. Your English is amazing. You just have to practice, right? right? That's great. You will inspire a lot of people. I、uh, hope so.、Too. I'm sure about that, <laughs> Lorenzo. Thank you so much for your participation. Do you know when、uh, there are videos on the channel? The days? I know that one is posted on Monday, and the other one. What time? Oh, the time I forgot. 
7 p.m. 7 p.m. And the other one, Wednesday? I just post once a week. Just once a week. Just once a week, Lurie, so I don't believe it. In front of everybody, you're saying that. I mean, yeah, because I, I used to just... post, I used to post yeah, twice a week. Because I forgot. Yeah. Not, I don't what I don't know the date of the video. So no, 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 really. Like, I, I used to post twice a week, right? But now I post once a week. But there are some surprises coming. Uh, thanks again. See you on Monday at 7 p.m. Bye bye, people. Bye bye.